Okay. I'm not playing Orc Massage. We're going to play more weird and unfortunate things are happening. Still watching Remy play Stanley Parable. Have you ever played it? No, I've never played that one, but I know I need to. Let's do like a half hour of this game. $8. Last time I played, all, all kinds of stuff happened, but now I'm in like this dream world. I have this little dude in my... In my uh, brain, and now I have uh, this chick with me as well. The, what? Huh? Yeah, I have to check out Stanley Parable. I want to play In Sound Mind as well. This is a weird place. I don't really know what. What? A, what? Uh, we're just getting started. Hello? I feel like something's gonna show up and it's like chasing me. I'm just playing Pac-Man right now. Ammo. Hello? Is this the beginning of the game? No, this is part two of this game. Did I just... Did I just get stuck? Oh, wait, what? Oh. No, if this game just started here, that would've been crazy. Oh, shit. I love this battle theme though. So you See you. See you. Oh. Oh, we leveled up. Incoming. New game. Oh. <laughs> Yo, what up, Remy? Remy with the raid. Welcome in, everybody. We are playing a game called Weird and Unfortunate. Things are happening. We're just getting started. We were playing a bunch of other stuff earlier. But that's what we do here. We just play whatever. <laughs> um, dude, I hope Stanley Parable was good. UPRC said watching you play was a trip. <laughs> Welcome, Raiders. Don't answer that. Here's Viola's clinic. Your friend you wanted to check on. That's right. I hope she and Eric are okay. Oh, shit. That's where we gotta go. But yeah, this is a cool RPG Maker game. It's coming to Steam soon. Good morning, big dog. Good morning, baby. Welcome in, dude. Fortune ticket. Hollow point ammo. Okay. Starting to suspect there's a fetish thing going on here. Hard to tell. Oh, Miriam. Oh, thank God. After I saw your house, Eric and I were about to head out when things all, when things went all hig, hig, higgledy piglity. It seemed like a good idea to stick it out in here. I'm glad to see you're all right, too. You got any doubt? Don't answer that. Well, you've been out there, right? I saw some policemen get taken down by a mass of red tentacles earlier. Ever since then, it's gotten really quiet, like everyone just vanished. It's nice to see someone else survived. Who's your friend? Oh, sorry, V. Eric, this is Alicia Copeland. Good to meet you. You guys haven't seen a girl around here, have you? Just turned 12, black hair, pigtails? Oh, a little girl? Oh, dear, no. I haven't seen any children alive since before this all happened. A child, your daughter? Niece. I'm afraid we haven't had the pleasure, miss. Sadie here came in a few hours ago. I've just been looking around. Any idea what's going on in the city? I'm sure you know as much as I do. No TV, phones, or internet after all. Like I said, we haven't exactly had many people to talk to. Little, ba little bagel, bro. What's up, dude? Uh, just wish list of this. Nice. Alright, enough chit-chat. You two look like you've been through the ringer. And I'd like to help keep someone alive here. Lucky you, you'll be my first patient today. Whoa, whoa, hold on, I'm currently- I'm current on all my vaccinations. Oh no, this is Viola Vaughn's patent pending panacea. One little sting and you'll be back to, to peak performance. This sounds more like an infomercial than a doctor's office. They've got all their licenses, Alicia. Stop being such a baby and take your shot. I'm not being a baby, I just wanna- Ow! 
No TVs, phones, or internet. Time for that nature walk. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, yep. Yeah. That before dinner, that before Thanksgiving walk with your cousin. Okay, I'll admit, this does seem to live up to the hype. I can't even see the mark anymore. I told you. What's in that stuff? All the physical ingredients are FDA approved. Physical? The extra ingredient is love. You sure you're a registered nurse? Hey, are you happy to be feeling better or aren't you? Are you planning on going out again, Miriam? Against my better judgment, yeah. Then I have some gifts for you too. Nice. Thanks a bunch. All patched up? V's a miracle worker, as always. Where'd you get all this stuff? Here and there. I like to collect little things once in a while. You mean you hoard stuff. Uh, don't come crying to me next time you need a vintage hoard ornament or a UV light bulb. Whatever you say, dear. Mind if we check out your wares? He's selling this? The price is right, sure. Let's see. Oh, equip stuff. Nice. Um, I want to buy one of those. Collect it, of course. Going to collect that money. Nice. Nice. Okay. Give me another item at the bottom. Um, find Alicia's niece in Ful Fulham Grove. Better take the back door. Okay. I had to chase off a few of those critters with a broom earlier. They still may be wandering about. With a broom? <laughs> the luck of the Irish? Neither of you are even Irish. We'll be alright, Marion. Maybe they don't even know how to use doorknobs anyway. Just don't die, alright? 10-4, good buddy. Will do. Stay alive too, okay? Don't worry, we will. Hopefully. They got random encounters in here. for good buddy <laughs> Obama what is it indigestion no okay Not sleeping today, baby. Oh. Gave me dread, dude. Remy, the, Remy, one cool thing about this game, this game, weird and unfortunate things are happening, which we're playing. One of the battle themes in this game was written by Casey Ozimi, who made uh, Jimmy and the Pulsating Mass. And you'll like know it. As soon as you hear it, it like it you you know it's a it's a it sounds like music from Jimmy. IP ammo. Enter the four-digit code to open the safe. Yeah, dude, it slaps. Oh. Hey, Margaret. Welcome in, dude. We're playing, we've been playing a bunch of games today, so we just got back into this one. This is weird and unfortunate things are happening, but it's very cool. It's been super fun so far. Don't look back. So this is our part two. One. Mm. Hello. This song, Remy. Slaps. 
Oh, I didn't realize you were switching around. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We like to play. I, I usually, when I stream, I play a bunch of stuff. It's so, it's just... So good. I'm a huge Casey Ozomi fan. Took that one to the bank, dude. Woo. Made my nose itch. It's a clean break. Okay, room two. The wretches of the expanse of two different languages. Okay, you're a good guy. Y'all is nice. Five oh two three. Ah, they're backwards. Now this is criminal locking away poor lonely SW ninety nine. Don't worry, baby, I'll make sure you get the love you need. Don't give me that look. Okay, this this next one is six four four two, so we gotta go back to that room. Crap. We're gonna fight before that, aren't we? Nope. Guess we are. Oh god, I gotta heal. Oh, we're dead. Maybe I can beat you before you beat me. No, probably not. Very risky. Oh, so close. Wow. Come on. Oh god. Okay, hold on. We gotta go. Thank you, thank you. We gotta go back. One more room. Heal me, please. Thank you. <laughs> okay, no more- no more farting around. No farting allowed in- Unless you really have to. Because I think retaining gas is probably not healthy. I think it's 6442. Hey. Easy puzzle for beginners. And babies. Yo, what's up? Money? Med kit, let's go. The soundtrack in this game is super sweet. The vibes are really right. I've enjoyed this so far. And this isn't really usually my style of game. Resist. 
All right. Nice, okay, I see. This is pretty good if you like earthboundy kind of games. Just wishlisted. Oh, cool, dude. Yeah, it's out. You can play it now if you want. It's available on RPGMaker.net, but it is coming to Steam in February, which it finally. It's a perfect game. To, it, it definitely needs to be on Steam. Very, very well made. Yeah. If you look it up, um, you could probably find the RPGMaker.net page for it. But I've been I've been trying to, to advertise it on coming to Steam, because that's really exciting. Oh. That'll- it'll open, but it'll be- wait, let me read that again? Open if you use a fool's key, but that key will turn to dust and be lost forever. Alright. Sure. I remember when my game came to Steam, it was amazing. One year ago. Oh, that was a transition, of course. How are things going on the non-spooky side of life? School going okay? Uh, I guess so. You guess so? I had to get my books out of the trash after social studies. I have no idea what you're talking about. Oh, she gets picked on. But she totally did it, didn't she? I, I was in the bathroom. I didn't actually see. You know, I could come to school and hold her down while you punch. What? No, no, no. I can't do that. Uh, oh, I'm just kidding. And it still is amazing. That's true. I'm just kidding. But seriously, you can't just keep letting her get away with all that crap. I know. Keep letting her be a little tyrant. She's gonna turn into a big tyrant someday. It's just... I just can't. Dotty. Whoa, hey, String Bean, what's the holdup? Oh, sorry, I guess my mind was wandering. Stay focused. You want to get yourself killed before we find her? Admittedly, Miss Copeland has chosen an opportune area to take leave of her concentration, as I sense no vermin in the immediate vicinity. The place was stinking with them a bit ago. What the hell? It does seem rather dubious, yes. I cannot fathom what could cause them to avoid this particular area. Let us remain cautious. I bet there's a boss. Sounds like there's a boss coming. Alicia has a frightful premonition. Something strange is waiting ahead. She's not, but she's not sure what. Okay. That's all I needed to hear. More flesh. Take and sacrifice. What the hell? <gasps> oh shit. To abduct someone into Venom Space Pocket. How craven. I'm going in after her. As you, as you will. I warn you, Miss Copeland. What lies beyond is no mere servant, but an avocation like myself. Don't care. Getting Miriam. I merely wish to warn you of what might, you might encounter. It has become abundantly clear that you have only the flimsiest instinct to survive in these situations. Yo, what up, Kiwi? We'll survive and we'll, and we'll get her back. Oh, we back here. Find the bean that took your friend, you'll find her as well as I suspect. Okay. What the heck is this thing? Place looks different than normal. What's going on? Seems that the abductor doesn't have much of a hold on this pocket of venom space. When you introduce your blonde friend into the area, it seems her mind began to shape the environment. Hmm. Okay. Hello? I 
I'm feeding. Go away. She fears you as well. Even the brave lose heart in a place like this. Hot like the sun. He. <laughs> Okay. Feast of Fury, I can't get my fill. So many are dead. Because of this, she is sad. Because of this, I can eat. Hmm. This is weird up here. Didn't you say these guys would always attack unless I beat them down? Hmm, I must admit, this behavior is quite abnormal. It would be, seem far wiser to set a guard of bloodthirsty beasts to patrol the entrance rather than these somnolent, somnolent wretches. Okay, glad I glad I got a break, I guess. Oh, what? In Pretty sure none of this was in anyone's budget. Miriam, dear, we really must do something about this habit of prying into things that aren't part of your job. Ugh. Miss Troutman, I wasn't prying really. I, the walls just opened, so... Ah, I can't fault anyone for being curious, I suppose. It's rather nice to have someone new to show it off to, really. Would you like a tour? Well, um, you know, I've got work to do and... Oh, Miriam, live a little. How could you turn down something this magnificent? Magnificent wasn't exactly the word I had in mind. More like gaudy or creepy. What's all this junk for, anyhow? Really, Miriam, I expected better of you. Say what? You've been such... A boon to me. All these years. Always loyal. Always competent. I, uh, do my best. But I suppose in the end you're not really a good fit for where the city is going. You don't have a vision. Go back to your desk and pack your things. What? Hmm. Since you've been such a good assistant, you should pack everything and leave Daybreak. What? Ah, like I said, you're not a good fit for where Daybreak is going. I've been here for the better part of a decade, worked my ass off for you almost all the time, and here you are saying none of that matters? That I don't belong here? You listen to me, you smug son of a... I'm more involved in this city than your pasty silver spoon candy ass ever could be. Really, now, I was hoping you'd take it better than this, Miriam. Where's your professionalism? You should appreciate my advice, you know. I've got big plans, old girl. Big plans. That was... What the hell was that? Seems this particular area of Venom space has been poorly maintained. Stray memories will often find their way uh, into whatever nooks and crannies are available and reproduce themselves. That was Miriam's memory? Under the circumstances, it seems the most likely option. If this space is channeling her memory, she, can be ter she can't be terribly far off. Then let's get going. Okay, let's go. Okay. Nothing here. Huh? That was weird. Uh oh. Oh, Jesus. Okay, sacrifice her now. Uh, you wait until the crucial moment to disobey? How? What's the problem? Master's hungry. Do you want to be a sacrifice? Do you? Miriam. Oh, boy. Okay, still alive. That's a good start. Why, Farudun, my dear Chun. Fancy meeting you in this. Oh, my. It seems you've gotten yourself into quite the embarrassing situation, haven't you? Miss Copeland, could you be a deer and... Busy with first aid here. Ugh, another outer loser. But he's brought me another human to sacrifice. Lucky day. Um, I would venture to say that dealing with this ill-mannered leech will ultimately prove to be a more fruitful use of your time, Miss Copeland. Merely remove that dreadful disfigurement from my dear fellow's head, and then you'll be able to see Miss God Goodwin without interruption. Makes sense. Alright, ugly hat. Batter up. Whoa. Your pathetic human efforts cannot harm me. Hey, Lothu, um, Ugly Hat here is kind of a little inside your buddy. I might have to, you know, smack him some, too. 
In this particular case, I am sure the sting of combat is nothing compared to the suffering of having fallen victim to this pathetic peon. You're going down, sacrifice number two. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, we're not doing any damage. Although, through having some issues here. Fret not, Miss Copeland, for your efforts, though meager, have paid off. While you toiled above, I worked below to sever the parasite's foul hold on dear Faridon's mind. Up. Hmm? Get up, human. Kill. Who am I killing here? Parasite. Um. Friend Miss Copeland fight. Not strong enough. You kill. Alicia? Okay, I'm there. Take gift of power. What? You got nothing and you know it. Yeah, but you're about to pitch in. Oh, that's a bigger rush than these stuff. So that's a parasite up there, huh? Sacrifices aren't supposed to get up. Hey, boy, you want a taste of your own medicine? Oh, she got ma she got magic now. Okay. That ridiculous thing's armor may protect it from physical blows, but it can't do nothing to prevent Feridon's poison of the soul. Is it why they call... It is why they call Feridon the Scourge. Enjoy it, Parasite. Now don't allow any quarter. Keep its attention. At least it finds some way to avert it to its doom. Avert its doom. All right, this is pretty easy otherwise. You know, that's a little rude. Oh, oh. Hmm. How much health do you have left? It doesn't have a health bar anymore, which is kind of weird. We just survive, I think. Oh, <laughs> okay. All right. <laughs> So you, oh, damn you all. Yo, Laco, what's up, dude? Laco, what's up? Welcome in. This is uh, weird and unfortunate things are happening that we're playing right now. Glad to have you back with us, old chum. However, did that dreadful thing get the better of you in the first place? Inner evocation. They forcibly enslaved you. Ghastly, absolutely ghastly. Even from the inner evocation, I would never have expected such barbarism. We cannot allow this humiliation to go unanswered. Pull in, humans bond, drain, give a sacrifice, do again, do again, could not stop. Such base acts as though you were nothing but vermin, it must have been simply appalling for you. All for big face Frytoch. Frytoch, eh? We absolutely must teach that scum in no certain unter uncertain terms that such behavior is not only unbecoming of an evocation, but that it is entirely unacceptable. Such an absence of any decorum, I simply cannot abide these inners and their incredible capacity for atrocious barbarism. Well, I have no idea what's going on now. 
I figured that one of these bad soul people's frit or something made Skullhead here do some do something. Yeah, I got nothing. Hey, big guy, what's the deal anyway? And why can I use weird mind powers now? If I were done, the scourge awoke, freed was we bone we bonded. You get power, friends. Hang on, buddy. I helped you because Alicia was in trouble. I wouldn't say we bonded in any. You have made a pact with Faradon. He is now bound to your spirit, as I am to Miss Copeland. He will accompany you on your journey, allowing you to unlock the power residing within your mind. And what? This big old cow skull is going to be following me and watching when I pee? I never agreed to any of this. I'm going to figure out a way to suit you. Hold on. What was that about powers? Strong mind, crush enemy spirit. They will shake, tremble, perish. Can't say I appreciate the lack of meaningful contract beforehand, but I gotta admit, the whole crushing my enemy spirit thing is mighty attractive. Welcome to the giant weird guys in our souls club, Miriam. Do I get a badge? Nope, just a partner with a loose grasp, grasp of mortality, or morality. Well, I had those at my last job, and this one gives me power, so I figure I'm ahead of the game. It pleases me greatly to see you take it so well to Faridon, Miss Goodwin. I assure you, he is a constant and capable friend whose talents, should you employ them, will take you far. I don't know if I want to go too far with you all. I keep ending up in creepy places. Well, hmm. At, that mo at the moment, I suppose it would be best to return to your little settlement. It seems unlikely that the inhabitants of this area of Vedum space will offer any useful information regarding Frytox whereabouts or ridiculous machinations. Perhaps further evidence will present itself as we investigate the matter of Miss Copeland's query. Quarry. Well, that was one hell of a side trip. Where were we going again? Fulgham Grove, Dottie's house. Oh yeah, east from the clinic. Are you going to be alright, Miriam, after all that? Right now, I'm kind of avoiding thinking about having a big skull monster stuck to me. Won't watch you pee. Okay, yes, thank you very much. Focusing on the mission now. Victory Sash. She will now recover four side points after every battle. Nice. Very helpful. Strawberry Fields Forever. books for us oh nice fight incoming at least we get this tune again Quickshot doesn't really do a lot of damage at all. That was rude. Oh my god. Okay, so he won't... The one guy won't die. The Scourge Rot doesn't, does, like, doesn't kill them past 1 HP. It just gets them down to 1. Okay. That's where I came from? Yeah, I did. Oh. Hmm. That's whoa. 
Can I kill you? No. Hey. Ah, damn it. Hey, regular space. Welcome in, buddy. I hope you have a great day as well. Thanks for being here. We're just playing weird and unfortunate things are happening. Which has been really fun. Status note. Oh, cool. Status says cool. Cool, cool, cool. Alicia's basic skills. Blah, 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 blah. Oh, thanks. Even though I just used the item. <laughs> uh, yep, take that. Oh, we could have went there the whole time. Nice. Just wasn't in the mood for that fight. <laughs> it isn't what we see. Decent daydreamer. Cool. I think we should destroy the robot, though. No resist? Oh, thank goodness. Nice. Oh. Wonder drug. Hell yeah. That's what it said on the wall. Get ready. Oh. That move sucks. Ouch.
Oh shit. That was dumb. Also dumb. I meant to use it on the other character, but that's fine. Tis what it is. Hello? A lot of cashish. Hello? Yo, Chili with the raid. What's up, dude? Welcome in, Raiders, where you're playing a game called Weird and Unfortunate Things Are Happening. Hell yeah. Bringing the heat, baby. Thanks for being here. What's going on? What were you guys playing? What's up, Metroid Sax? What's up, Shadow? What's up, Zax? Welcome in, everybody. This game is weird and unfortunate things are happening. It's a cool RPG Maker game, and it's coming to uh, it's coming to Steam um, February third, I think. So if you're interested, weird and unfortunate things are happening is what it's called. You could uh, wish list it right now, and it's free. It's a free game. Repent before it's too late. Well, that's not public art. What is it? Hostile, it looks like. Guess we gotta go through it. Crusader Kings 3. Ooh, that sounds cool as heck. Or Orca Defender. Poison it. Attack it. Oh, 9, 18, 27, 30. That was a lot of damage. Nice. Oh, a stun. Oh, it got uglier. Remain on your guard. I sense a, a surge in its strength. Weaknesses change too. Hell yeah. No, thank you for the raid. I hope you guys had fun. Yo, Katie Danger, what's up, buddy? Forgot the raid message. All good, dude. Appreciate it. I don't think I've ever played Crusader Kings. She countered. That was sick. Hey. I hope everything's been good for you all. Hope you're having a nice start to your weekend, or maybe... Maybe, uh, you know, you're knee-deep in your weekend if you ha if you started it yesterday. Oh, bye. No, that's not cool. It's fun if you like strategy, dating simulators, incest, and murder. Sad, sad synapse. Thank you for that. That's maybe not. <laughs> maybe I'm not interested. As long as y'all have fun, that's all I care about, you know? I'll just beat it up. Emphasis on the last two, I hate that. <laughs> okay, opened up. Your weekend started all right? I'm doing pretty good. I'm actually, so I'm actually in a pretty interesting spot in my life right now where I'm about to give my two weeks for my job that I have now to start another job. And with that will come a week afterwards that I can just hang out and relax. So I'm excited for three weeks of just kind of doing nothing. Doing the bare minimum and then doing nothing. Oh, thank you so much, Kiwi. It's with a it's with a local college that I really uh, local university that I really um enjoy. So I'm excited uh, to get started. But before that happens, I'm gonna do as much Twitch and internet stuff as I can. Just a lot of cool stuff to look forward to, so. Come on, you're so close to dead. This will be the end of our stream once we beat this weird enemy thing. 
Ah, don't kill me, though. Quick attack. I think we're almost there. But yeah, at a very interesting point, um, I'm just doing really well. See ya. Bye bye. Oh, thank goodness that's over with. Good riddance. I surmise that these more and more, these more powerful vermin have been placed as enforcers by the inner evocations. Most powerful vermin. Ho ho ho! Ha ha ha! Yes, those inner evocations are rather like vermin themselves, aren't they? Quite droll, my dear friend. Quite droll indeed. And I thought Mr. Troutman's jokes were bad. Cool, 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 cool. I think. We're doing pretty good. Though I think we actually have to get out of here. I think stream's gotta end. Miriam, look, look. Oh. Yeah, I've seen it before. The Sea Fun Park. Uh, I remember it being a really cute idea when it was built. Not a fan of how octop the octopus turned out, if I'm being honest. Me and Dottie used to play here all the time. Like, whenever I came to visit, she loves this place. And our neighbor's just north of here. We're almost there. Let's go, let's go. All right, let's go save that niece of yours. Hold on, not yet. Not yet, gotta go. I want to collect all the goodies. I want to get to this point right here, and then we'll save it there. Yo, Savage Dad, what's up, dude? Good to see you, my friend. Uh, get this shit out of here. Take that. Uh, any more? Did we miss anything else? This song literally just sounds like a really groovy XX song. Holy crap, that's a lot of enemies. Oh shit. Ouch. Woo! I finally made it, albeit way late. No problem, dude. This is a pretty unusual time for me to stream, but... Um... You know, we gotta get it in while we can. However, we are going to finish up. Oh. Hello? Did my audio just cut out? Oh, my headphones popped out. <laughs> I was like freaked out. All right. Well, that was <laughs> that was enough weird and unfortunate things are happening. I, I seriously highly recommend you find this game on Steam and wishlist it. Um, so far, so good with it. I've really enjoyed it. It's very clean. The music's really good. The art and stuff is really neat. Um, and yeah, having fun. So, we'll be back. We'll play more of this soon.